Okay, we have just a couple of measures left to learn of Deck the Halls, the last two measures of the main section of the song that we're learning. So let's start in measure 21 and 22. That's when you've done this. Your left hand is on this F here. You want to get your thumb on that F for the last two measures of the song. So you want to do your thumb on F and put your pinky on B flat. So this is the second to the last measure. Then just move your pinky down to A. And now the last measure is G, C. And it wants you to go up to this F and then go, go down an octave. You don't have to do that. You can just go G, C, and then this F. Okay? I'll show you that again. So you've come out of this, whatever finger you're using here doesn't matter because then you're going to put your thumb on it and play B flat and then A and then G, C and F. Don't worry about going back up to that high F, you can just cross that out. That's the third beat of the last measure. You don't have to do that. Just go G, C. Now the right hand, we've just come out of this in F position. The last two measures, the music shows that they want you to play some chords. You're welcome to do that. If you decide you want to play the chords, here's what you do. Keep your thumb on F, pinky goes up to D. Then pinky comes down to C. Then play B flat with your fourth finger, and then you just go three, two, one in the last measure. It's pretty easy. Now, if you want to leave out that bottom note F right here, you can just go up to D with your pinky and go four on C and turn finger two over to F. So you need to make a choice. Am I gonna play these Fs on the bottom? That's pretty easy. Or are you just gonna play one note at a time? In which case it's this. And turn finger two over to get to that final F. Now, here's the challenge for you. Once you decide which one you're going to do and you practice that a few times, I know you can get those last two measures hands together. Here's what it will look like. I'm going to do the F on the bottom of the right hand. Just moving in baby steps. One more time. We're not doing this in the left hand. We're not going up to that high F. We're just playing. So work on those last two measures, hands separate. Decide how you want to do the right hand. I think you should do this with the F on the bottom. And then I know you can get it hands together. Very slowly is fine.